folks, Craig here, and today we're going to be taking a look at a PSP 3000. Um, I got a limited edition entertainment pack bundle here with Invisimals and a USB camera, a 1 gig uh, memory stick, and a uh, copy of Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs on UMD, which I'm sure I'll never watch. Um, I do own a PSP 2000, uh, this silver model here. Uh, which I got back when they first came out, uh, but I've been having some issues with it lately that, um, you know, hasn't made playing games impossible, just really, really difficult. And I think the issues stem with the UMD drive. Uh, you know, I, I get these really weird um, hiccups in loading where the game will just hang for like 30 seconds, 45 seconds at a time randomly. Um, I'll get these moments where like it's as if someone pressed the home button and it asked me if I want to quit the game. Which I, I would imagine that um, that might happen if you were to open the UMD drive while a game was playing. I've never done it, but uh, I, I would imagine that's what would happen. Um, and I'm, I've also got some discoloration in the screen. It started in the corners and it slowly spread inward. Um, so playing playing the PSP is not much fun. Uh, truthfully, I don't really have much luck with Sony hardware. Um, I've owned every system they've put out, and my PS3 is still going, but uh, that's a uh, that's an original 60 gig model, and I hear those like to go out to lunch too. So I'm just waiting for that thing to die as well. Uh, so uh, <laughs> it, it sucks, but uh, you know, Sony systems also have great libraries. So it's like, you know, you know, this thing's taking a hike. But what do I do? Just you know, tell my 50 some odd PSP games up. Oh, sorry guys, we had a good run. Not playing it anymore. I can't do that. Um, so uh, I picked this up. It's just hard to find. These bundles are becoming a little little harder to find. I really wanted the Invisibles one because. I like the blue, and I've, uh, I I kind of want to give Invisibles a shot. Sort of an augmented reality, uh, Pokemon-esque battling game. So, seemed pretty interesting. But uh, let's get this bad boy open and take a look at the PSP. Alright, got the seals undone. And uh, open up this box, which interestingly has everything uh, also in French. Which, uh, not particularly common here in the U.S. If you see a multilingual packaging, it's uh, usually English and Spanish. So, uh, that's sort of weird. Uh, but we open this up. Holy crap, that PSP is blue. We'll get to that in a minute. I haven't seen one of those in person. Open me first. Alright, we'll do that. Oh, this is sort of nice. I like this sort of packaging here. Can't remember if my PSP 2000 came like this, but this is kind of nice. Some quick start stuff on the inside of this. And a uh, more traditional quick start guide. Um, some exclusive Invisimals content, I guess. Uh, some Invisimals augmented reality stuff here. This card, uh, manual, maybe? Let's take a look. Yep, it's very, very thin, which is why I second-guessed. Uh, instruction booklet for the USB camera. Um, peripheral compatibility notice. Accessories. Protection plan, you know, obviously they want to send, sell you more stuff than what you just bought. And a PSP uh, instruction manual. I don't need to open this, I know how to work it, but there's the instruction manual. It's got some thickness to it. Do not throw away. Contents contain camera. I don't know why I say it has to say contents contain camera. Seems a little redundant, but uh, there's the camera. It's very small. Let's get this open. Yeah, wow, that's that's tiny. Plugs right into the top of the PSP there, and you screw it down with this guy right here. And the camera swivels, which is very convenient. Feels a little light, a little cheap. Uh, I wasn't expecting that, but uh, all in all, seems kind of okay. Power cord here, and I'm sure the adapter's in here somewhere. Cloudy with a chance of meatballs on UMD, and uh, <laughs> I don't know why they put them in these slips. Um, maybe because you know it's it's easier to pile them in this packaging. I, ha I hate these cardboard slips. Give me a case, man. And here's Invisimals. Again, cardboard slips. So yeah, here's the other part of the adapter here, and that doesn't want to come out. I don't want to break you. Yeah, that was that was kind of rough. And uh, this just plugs into here. There you go. Uh, one gig Memory Stick Pro Duo. Uh, 1200 milliamp hour 
battery there, pretty standard stuff. And of course we have the PSP, which is, man, that is, that is blue, I'll tell you what. <sighs> That's a nice looking PSP, I like that. <laughs> now here it is compared uh, to the 2000, we have 2000 here, 3000 here. Uh, not too many differences, obviously, besides color. Uh, the home button's a little different, it has the uh, PS logo there. See that? And this one just says home. And it's differently shaped, so a little, little different there. And on the back, um, not sure why this is, but these, this, this circle here on the UMD drive, smaller? That's okay by me. Um, I hear the screen's a bit different. Uh, this one's a bit sharper, uh, less ghosting. Uh, but I also heard there were some problems with uh, some lines running through the screen or something like that on the on the 3000. Uh, so maybe there's some give and take with the different kinds of screens on the 2000 and on the 3000. Here we have the D-pad, which I love. I love the PSP's D-pad. Um, you know, it's a traditional Sony D-pad, but uh, this sort of hard plastic, I really like this a lot. Uh, we have the analog num here. Home button, volume down, volume up. Uh, I would assume that's the microphone right there. Uh, this changes the brightness of the screen. Um, I think this mutes uh, the the volume. I'm not 100% sure. I don't think I've ever pressed that button. Uh, select start. And again, these are the select start are slightly different shapes. And traditional Sony face buttons, stereo speakers, L, R, um, a hardware wireless switch, which is very convenient because uh, wireless does uh, take down battery life, and it's nice to be able to just uh, have it off or turn it on whenever you need it. We have accessory jacks here, micro USB, UMD drive. On the side, uh, this is where the uh, memory stick goes right in there. Wait for the camera to focus. It's not gonna. It's having a tough time. Sorry about that. Uh, battery cover is right here. You disengage it by hitting that. Uh, it's where you charge, your headphone jack right there. And here's the on-off switch, which is a slider. You click it up to turn it on. Uh, well, you hold it up for a few seconds and it turns on, and you can hold it up again to turn it off. If you, While it's on, if you just sort of click it upward, it goes into uh, sleep mode, um, which I've done a lot by playing. You sort of hold it and you kind of nudge it. I've never shut it off doing that, thankfully, but I put it in sleep mode quite a bit. Let's get the battery in there so we get the true weight of the system. I don't know, I might be crazy, but I actually think it's a little bit lighter. I think the 3000 actually is a, is a little bit lighter than uh, the 2000. But just like the 2000 feels good in the hand, um, you know, after some extended play sometimes, the PSP and even the DS, uh, you know, you get a little crampy. But uh, all in all, this does feel pretty good. I have no complaints about it. Here we have the camera attached, and uh, we have it facing forward right now, but I suppose if you're playing Invisimals, you'll want to face it away and uh, put out one of these cards, I suppose, and... Uh, action transpires on the screen. Uh, pretty cool stuff. So there you have it folks, the contents of the PSP 3000 Entertainment Pack with Invisimals. Uh, we also have Cloudy of Chance of Meatballs with, uh, on, on UMD here. We got the uh, Augmented Reality Card, one gig stick, and uh, the charger, and of course the camera. Uh, I really like the blue. The blue is just terrific on this thing. Uh, so I'm gonna go give this game a shot. Uh, I wanna thank you for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed this, and until next time, you guys take it easy.